Knowing about URL slugs makes it easy for website visitors to remember your page addresses and helps Google to index your web pages correctly. So ahead of this video, you should have a website that is live and have watched our video on e-commerce SEO to gain a basic understanding of what we mean by SEO or search engine optimization. A page address slug is the defining part of the URL which distinguishes this particular page from other pages in your website in an easy to read format. And this helps to explain what the page's content is about to both Google and people who visit your website. In this sense, slugs play an important role in how Google ranks the pages in your website and you can choose what a page's slug is when you create a new page on your website. So every item, group, category, deep page, blog post, listing and any other page you create on your website has an area like this one where you can give a unique slug that describes what the page is about. So if this page was about women's shoes, for example, the URL slug would be something like women shoes. And you should only ever write in this section when you're creating a page. And you should avoid changing a slug after a page goes live as the page might lose its current standing on Google. And make sure you check the slug to see that it's unique and can be used on your website ahead of creating Create. You can see here how slugs work now for pages that sit inside bigger pages. So this is a blog post about wedding hair accessories that sits inside a wider blog about fashion tips. And the complete slug tells Google and your readers who are visiting your blog firstly what this content on this particular page is about and that it sits inside a wider blog about fashion tips. Now this blog post is titled the best hair accessories to wear for a wedding and if I were to leave this slug blank an automatic slug would be generated with every word of that title which makes it a little bit harder for Google to find because of the unnecessary words and can be confusing for your readers. So a good way to write slugs is to only include the words that are absolutely necessary. So in this case, it would be wedding hair accessories, like so. And remember to separate each word inside a slug with a dash and make sure that slugs are always in lowercase. And this is because in some cases, you could create duplicate content by mixing uppercase and lowercase letters. And with that, you now know what slugs are and how they can be determined by you, the website owner, whenever you add a new page to your website, which gives your pages the best chance of being indexed correctly by Google and also means that visitors to your website can clearly understand what every page in your website is about, allowing for easier navigation. So be sure to watch our video now on e-commerce SEO if you haven't already. Thank you very much for watching and I look forward to speaking with you again soon.